Hi, Shaban. How are you doing? I'm all right. Aren't you fed up with the everyday hustle and bustle of life? Yes, I am. Going to work, yes. doing the same thing over yes. and over. Yes. Don't you need some excitement in your life? I do. Do you need an adventure in your life? Yes, I need Well, guess what? Today on The Shopping Show, we'll be taking you on an adventure filled with fun and excitement at Arrow Point Nature Resort. So just sit back, enjoy the fun, excitement, and adventure. And remember, you can get back to nature too at Arrow Point Nature Resort. On today's adventure, we will be meeting up with a team that just came back from the Kaitra Falls with Roraima Airways. We will be taking the Arrow Point Water Shuttle at Samiri to Arrow Point Nature Resort, a 45 minute journey up the Demwara River. Yeah, we have uh, Derek, Edward, we have Elwin there, myself, and we have one more staff up there. And we hope that you'll have a nice time if you short. So, I'll take you up where you have your lunch. Edward will give you a brief orientation of the safety of the resort. <laughs> Look down through your window, no big city lights, just greenery. I don't know what you come for. Listen up, my dear, with such a man free. Welcome to the land of many faces, not one, not two, but six different races. You know when the sun gets your skin, you're in the Hi, viewers, welcome back to the Shopping Show. We're here with the beautiful Zena, and she's the head chef of Arrow Point, and she's going to be telling us what she prepared for us today. Hi, Zena, how are you? Hello, how are you doing? I'm good. Welcome to our point again. I am Zina. I'm the cook for today, the head chef. And we'll be having there's rice, chicken curry with potatoes, dal, fried fish, pumpkin, and there's some roti. So, are you preparing any uh, like Amerindian dishes for us? No, there isn't any. Based on request, we do our Indian dishes. Oh, okay. Yes. So other than this, but this uh, is a standard menu. Okay. So other than this, uh, the guests can request specific meals. Yes. Fish and As you can see, it's lunchtime here at Arrow Point. Well viewers, if you're now joining us on the shopping show, we've just had a lovely lunch prepared by Zina, the head chef here at Arrow Point. And I'm stuffed. The food was delicious. Well, we're about to do the orientation where the tour guide is going to give us a brief description of uh, the journey from Tamiri to Arrow Point. And he's going to tell us a bit about the activities that we'll be doing later on in the day. You guys having fun? Yes. You enjoying the tour so far? Mm -hmm. All right, so good afternoon, and um, my name is Edward, and one of the senior tour guide at our point, and you also met Derek, the other boat captain, and um, Sharon, Zena is the one who prepare all the meals and stuff. So I must say welcome again to our point, and our point, it's a back to nature resort, and also it's a nice getaway 
people who come from very far from abroad and even Guyanese our local Guyanese right so it's nice having you here today and um, because you're on a Kai Chor trip um, you came straight into lunch and um, we gonna do a tour which is called the Wabani Expedition Tour but we're not gonna do the full tour we are just gonna do like half of it because of the time so you can probably come back here and you can swim you can kayak some more you can pedal boat and also we also do like mountain biking but that wouldn't be doing today because of your time so we're just gonna do a little short walk in the forest and then we do some kayaking back to the resort right so let me just do a little retrace of your journey today. So we now come into the Komuni Creek and we pass this Hope Town. Like five minutes into the Komuni Creek. And as you come into the Komuni Creek, you would notice the bamboos. Both sides of the creek was planted also by the Chinese. So you either call it Hope Town or Chinatown. So we continue into the Pokorero, I mean the Komuni Creek, sorry. All the way here into Waratilla. Passes Waratilla, we come to Cashew Landing, Johnson Landing, Tiger Farm, and then we come to the Comuni Pokorero Creek Junction. So we now enter into the Pokorero, which the Comuni now branches off on the right hand side. So we continue into the Pokorero, we pass the first village, which is Aritak, and then we come to Santa Mission, which we normally would stop on a day tour, not on Kai Chor. So we continue, we pass this Santa Mission, then Timberhead. That's the resort just before us, right? And then we finally arrive at Arrow Point Nature Resort. So it's a back to nature resort and an eco resort also. So the activities and the things that we do wrong are wrong here is not interested to the environment, right? So today we're gonna be doing some of the stuff. Now I must say that the name Arrow Point comes from the many arrow plants or the arrow trees so as you come up from the from the boat you will notice the same like both sides of the the resort so that's the arrow plants it looks just like sugar cane right if you look around you can see them and this here it's a real arrow but not a real point right so you normally make the um, steel point to go maybe shoot your animals your fish your birds whatever you go hunt the nature part of the resort are the buildings Right, so if you look across, um, you got the duplex, we got the two um, single cabins, the walls are made from the manicole palm, and also the thatch roof is a truly palm, which is a spe special type of palm we use for the thatch roof. Today, we're going to do the Wabani Expedition Tour. So what we're going to do, we're going to just do a little short walk here, and then we go into this trail across the Acre Junction, and then we come back to Tarantula. And then we head back to ET Landing. So we're going to do a short walk, come down here, and then the kayak should be up here for us. This is where you're going to kayak your way back to the resort. So that's the Wabney Expedition Tour, but a short one. We normally do it on a day tour, where we do a longer tour, where we take like half an hour hiking in the, in the trails, and then we come to the Wabney. Now, the Wabney, it's a hide or a platform that built into the trees to do like hunting during the night not in the day so if you notice that the Canadian High Commissioner he's just pretending that he was, he was hunting right for lunch so do we normally do that when we come to the Wabani and then we go to Lucky Seed Landing this is on the day tour so the next time you come back on a day tour this, this is how long we're gonna go and we come through Alligator Alley and back to Labaria Point into the Pokorero ETA Landing Warakaba and if you get back there would be a lovely lunch <laughs> on a day tour, right? Yeah. Um, so you gotta pass out this and if you don't get back, that's the way. They have you for lunch. Yeah, they have you for lunch, <laughs> and that's the way how myself and the other staff would eat, because we would now eat your lunch. Mm -hmm. So please, I'm and I mean, I'm saying this just to let you come back the next time, so you can have that kind of longer, more experience and in the forest so we're just going to do the short one today and then we get back you guys can swim you can kayak and some people would ask if it got piranhas no there is no piranhas um we have caimans right <laughs> but during the day they would be like very far from the creek 
<laughs> at night now they would come out and look for the fishes that would come to the corner. So there's no need to be scared of going into the water. The water is great. I will tell you, when you get in there, you want to come out this afternoon. We have to get you out from that. It's fresh, black water. It has nothing to do with your skin, right? A lot of people scare the black water, but it's okay. You can take a dip inside this afternoon when we come back. Um, so this afternoon, uh, once you pre when you prepare after you finish this afternoon, about I would say about 3.30, um, we're going to now prepare ourselves to leave here about 4 o'clock, and we're going to go back the same journey, get you back to the marina, so you should be back in Georgetown by 6 this afternoon. All right, until you decide to come back, on the night tour also, where we do the bonfire dinner. So you're going to get a group maybe sometime this year, next year, and you can come back and you can experience the night tour, which is the creatures of the night after the bonfire. So we do the bonfire first, then we do a walk in the trail. Um, That's where you're looking for the eyes of the animals, the birds, the snakes, the jaguars. So these are the experience at night. Um, we also got the destination of bird lovers. So we got a lot of people would come here. Uh, people retire from work and they came over here, mostly English speaking. And um, they would come to do like birding, maybe two or three days. So this is the, the activities and also on the day tour, we would do some mountain biking. Sorry because the time, we cannot do that today. So we're just gonna do the short walk and then we come back. And then you, who's want to just sit and relax, enjoy the breeze, those who want to go into the water, those who want to kayak some more, you can do that. So this afternoon we leave here at 4 o'clock. Well, viewers, we just had an orientation by one of the tour guides and we're going to be going on a 50 minute hike into the jungle, unexplored jungle, where there are caimans and alligators and, and wild animals can get you. Just joking. And we're off on our 50 minute hike through the jungle. As a tour guide would have mentioned, this is just part of the trail we are doing because it's the Kaichiro Arrow Point package. So we'll only be doing 50 minute hike, then to the uh, canoes or um, then to the boats where we're gonna kayak our way back to Arrow Point. If we're going to do the one day tour or overnight, where you will get the full experience of Arrow Point, that will include an extended trail hike, about an hour long, board watching, day and night hiking, mountain biking, and extended kayaking trail. You'll also learn a little about the uh, vegetation around the area and how the natives would set out to catch their food. There will also be night hiking and extended kayaking trail. Well, my friend Shaban is a bit drained after all the fun and excitement we've been having here at Arrow Point. So after kayaking and dipping in the creek, she'll be heading back to one of the cabins to prepare herself for dinner and our departure. Well, like they say, all good things must come to an end. Remember, if you want to get back to nature, if you would like to have some fun and excitement in your life, if you want to get away from the everyday hustle and bustle of everyday work and life, Arrow Point Nature Resort is the place for you and your family. So how was your day tour at Arrow Point? It was an excellent day, um, much more than we expected. Enjoyed everything, the kayak in the river and the bike ride. Food, hospitality, everything excellent. was just great. Right. Recommend excellent. it to anybody. Yes, come, come and to, enjoy. Come to Arrow Point, you'll have a, good, yes. a great day. Great day, yes, fantastic.
So we're gonna do the night one as well. Oh, you're gonna be coming back for night oh, uh, sure. overnight at yes, some point, yes. Sure, All yes. right, good. Well, thank yes. you so much and for, for choosing Arapoy. God bless you. you all.